What's up, gang? Once again, it's me. <laughs> LA understood. Yawn. Yeah, for real. Yawn. Undisclosed location. Because maybe I'm on vacation. Ah, check out the freestyle, baby. <laughs> Watch out, world. Here come the dopest rapper on the planet. Um. Oh, yeah. Real talk. I was looking through my photo album, you know, on my phone. And you guys I had an epiphany. I had a Oprah Winfrey aha moment. Testify. Thank you, Jesus. I'm oh, just teasing. <laughs> okay, what I have to say is um, maybe the, the, the meaning behind um, the saying a picture has a thousand words or says a thousand words or a picture tells a thousand words is this. Okay, you guys know that my dog, he passed away. Um, so I ran across one of his pictures that he was wearing a birthday party hat. And I kid you not, it was kind of eerie to come across that picture now that he's gone. It, it made that picture literally seem more realistic. It seemed like it came to life more. It was creepy because when I used to look at the picture when my dog was here, Francisco, it just seemed one dimensional, one and a half dimensional. But now that he's gone, I see everything. Like, even the background. You know, I mean, why would I cherish the background? It's the cabinet, the kitchen cupboard, the cabinet. What I need to be cherishing is Francisco's dog. But everything in that picture stands out. It's creepy because it seems like the picture is alive. And I think that's the only reason the camera was invented. Yeah, to create memories, but... To, okay, I'm a freak. Some people out freak myself out, but to use pictures in the image to allow it as a portal for those spirits that moved on, passed away, who got murdered, per se, you know. You know, per se, behind murder, who got murdered or who just passed away, it's, it's, it's a portal for them to come look through that image at us to see how we're doing. It's a, another open source for them to... um communicate to people because that wigged me off that I want to delete it honestly <laughs> it looked like that picture that dog was alive like he was talking to me his eyes looked like they had water in them and all this crazy stuff um it really wigged me out maybe that's why my hair looked like this because I was like ah! photos in my house you know not everybody in my albums passed away but now I kind of don't want to look at the photo of my um my aunt Lois because she passed away I don't even want to go downstairs and look at the photos of her because shoot, that mug might look real in the mug you know that's why I don't even keep those obituary programs when people pass away. Why people keep those? Come on. I, I throw them away, you know. Um, yeah, speaking of, how come some... Oh, this is a deja vu moment. That's a good thing. I'm happy to see today. Aren't we all happy to see another day? Um... How come some people be, um, <laughs> black people, <laughs> how come some people be <laughs> taking the camera to a funeral? You know, they were talking about some, I just want to take a picture of the body, see how he and she look peaceful and beautiful on their final days. What you mean they final days? <laughs> That's gone. <laughs> you don't need to be taking a picture of nobody in the casket. That is gross. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, I know if you didn't make it to hang out with those people, I'm sorry for you. 
<laughs> you better ask them. No, I gave you some peace because uh, you don't need to be taking no pictures of nobody in the casket. That's crazy. I know every YouTube video I make not going to touch the lives of every soul who subscribed to me. <laughs> in fact, somebody might unsubscribe. <laughs> But I have to speak my mind. This is like a living journal for me. And I've learned that since I've been it for Francisco's passing that these video journals have been a um, good way for me to vent, to relieve some stress. So it's been helping me. So lately these videos have been helping me more than probably helping the masses of people who I always reach. You know, I'm in the millions now. <laughs> I got so many views. Beyonce jealous. You know, um, I got a phone call from, um, <laughs> I, can't, I can't even be serious. I got a phone call from Justin Bieber. He want to put his latest video on my page because I got more hits than him. <laughs> Real talk. Real. MF and talk. Yeah, um. I got so many subscribers. You two got a waiting list. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but that's all I had to say. A picture says a thousand words. And I think that's why that saying came about. Because when my dog died, that picture captured the moment. And when I look back at it after he passed, I kid you not. That picture looked real in the MF. And it's scary. Um, Yeah, that's real talk. That's the only reason I think a camera was invented. Some spiritual stuff behind it. Because pictures do say a thousand words. Not only do pictures say a thousand words from like a camera. But even the stuff that's written on the walls. You know from ancient times. It is what it is. You know it ain't no alteration to it. Well they altered it now but. What they put on those walls was exactly what they meant. Just like simple times. Like when the kid draw a picture. It don't get no realer than when a kid draws a picture of their family, you know. They be like, um, there's my mom, my dad, my cat, and my dog. They be like, well, where's Peter? Oh, Peter's gone. And the cops be like, what do you mean Peter's gone? Here's a picture of Peter. He's here. What do you mean Peter's here in a trash can? Either this kid's got a sense of humor or something's going on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> So, yeah, I just really had um, to race to the camera to record this and say that, um, yeah, pictures do say a thousand words. So, people look back on your pictures. Maybe y'all need to get rid of some of them. Um, or pray that um, the spirit be detached from the picture. But, no, nah, that really kind of had me shaky a little bit because it's true. Pictures say a thousand words and more. So, um, yeah, that's all I have to say. I feel better now that I said it. I'm thankful for YouTube. YouTube can be utilized for good or for bad. Just like how people say with magic. You know, magic is neutral. It can be used for good or for bad. YouTube is neutral. It could be use for good or for bad so you know take take the good out of youtube you know and do your best to ignore the negative it's everywhere but um yeah i'm thankful for the youtube i'm thankful for it being here so thank you youtube company you know for being invented because it helps that's all picture said a thousand words review your pictures See what you might find.